Over 14 years, Ajoke Ayusat Afalabi Foundation, a dream organization that seeks to improve humanity, has been at the forefront of providing access to medical services, education, and economic empowerment for the people with disabilities, orphans, and vulnerable children and widows. We've done our best to contribute to the Agenda 2030 of leaving no one behind. Uh, we've um, contributed uh, so much to the lives of uh, vulnerable households in the area of education. Uh, by providing scholarship to over 20,000 households across Nigeria, helping um, children of widow-headed households to access education. Uh, we've um, also in health, we have been able to do public you know, health. We have a clinic. We have also we also regularly you know get involved in quarterly health um, outreach and also um, economic empowerment for widows for women generally. So we, we've contributed our own quarter to helping our poor resource poor households across Nigeria improve like their lifestyles. Founded by the children of late Alaja Ayisat Afolabi, the bigger picture of the foundation is to elevate poverty where people with education, skills and financial ability will have quality life. This uh, foundation has created a huge impact on Nigerians. It has helped many Nigerians by empowering them in such a way that uh, we were able to provide them with the right tools so that uh, they can live well. The impact of the foundation in the last 14 years reverberates through various programs focusing on widows and orphans. Unfolding national developmental issues also receive equal attention with Ajoke Aishat Afalabi Foundation undertaking other humanitarian and charitable activities as duty calls. I was here when the foundation held a seminar on gender-based violence. And being that this school is a school of girls, you know, I, I, I really appreciated how the students responded, the impact it had in their life. How did I know? I saw the way they were asking questions, showing their interest, and knowing that this thing is what is prevalent in our society. While I was watching, I, I reflected in the environment where I reside, where I have issues like that, women violated, girls raped, and uh, pregnant, young, uh, you know, and I will, I'm appealing that the foundation should come and hold a program like that in my environment. Vocational Skill Acquisition Project, VSAP, for economic empowerment of women, girls, and persons with disabilities has also been impacted. The foundation identified the important role of women in the agricultural business value chain, hence the involvement in women in agricultural projects which has liberated many from the cycle of poverty. Apart from the core areas of investment in humanity, the foundation undertakes quarterly community medical outreach to promote routine medical examination, disease treatment, counseling and drug supply by qualified health workers. The ultimate to be a world-class foundation consistently improving quality of life is apt and evident in the progression of its assignment. We've come a long way since 2008. Uh, from one office in Lagos, we now have offices across Nigeria. We have an office in Zaria, Kaduna State. We also have another office in Umahia, Abia State. We have a primary health care uh, center at Isadi in Ogun State. And of course, we just started a satellite uh, office in Abuja uh, to bring our presence you know, more uh, to stakeholders, there, particularly uh, government and multilateral agencies. Uh, from just um, the support of CIFAS group, we have also been able to um, partner with other non-profit, partner with government. We've also been able to partner with the World Bank Group Tap Community Connection Campaign Project. And through that effort, we have uh, reached you know, more people Managed by highly resourceful individuals, the foundation has a track record that speaks volume in dedication, passion, and commitment towards a better society. Popular among the Ajoke Aisad Afalabi Foundation programs is the SAC Poverty. Support a child with the knowledge to reduce poverty, which promotes access to education for orphans and vulnerable children through scholarship and educational competitions. At least 2,000 youth and children have benefited since its debut. Activities of the foundation cannot be 
overemphasized. We've been running it by the grace of God with the helpful hand of our able doctor, Taiwa Afolabi, who have been the strength of this foundation, not forgetting his wife. Over the years, the Ajoke Ayusat Afolabi Foundation has put smile on youths, women, orphans, and people living with disabilities, expanding hundreds of millions. We should try and be helpful to our fellow Nigerians. Uh, because if you look around the whole world, today you will see that uh, there is a lot of hardship. You know, so and Nigeria is not uh, uh, exempted as uh, AF is trying to help people. Let all of us have open hand and let us see how we can help ourselves. And uh, at the same time, uh, we appeal to people that can be of assistance or that want to partner with uh, AAF to please do so, so that um, we can jointly help people that are less privileged or people that are in need. It welcomes donations, materials, and financial from partners who identify with the core values of the foundation and the need to create a better society for all.